Hello friends, welcome to my channel once again. In today's video, we will be installing Ubuntu, that is uh, a Linux based operating system, but it looks like Windows. So in my previous video, uh, we have seen how we can install Ubuntu, that is a Plasma Windows 11 theme. And uh, the first video was about Linux FX Red Sen. So if you have not seen those videos, please go and check those videos. And this will be the third operating system, which we will be installing on VMware. And it will be Ubuntu Cinnamon Windows 10 theme. So we'll initiate the ISO download. You can check the system requirement. I will give you the link in the description. So click on download and it will take us to the download page and we will click on the file that is windows ubuntu uh, with copilot windows 10 cinnamon iso and a file will start getting downloaded so it may take up to 15 minutes so let's just wait till it completes Our file has been downloaded. Now I'll just close this and we'll open up our VMware software and we'll create a virtual machine. Click on create virtual machine. Leave it like this and click next. Click next again. Here we will select Microsoft Windows, which is already selected, Windows 10 and later, and then click Next. Here we will give it a name. I'll name it Ubuntu Win 10 and click Next. 60 GB hard drive space is sufficient. Select the second option and then click Next and click Customize hardware here. I'll increase the RAM to 4 GB. I'll change the number of cores per processors to 2. Now click CD, DVD and select your file which you have downloaded. I mean the ISO file. And that is in our download. That is the one. So I'll just select that. And now click close and finish. So our virtual machine for Ubuntu Windows 10 theme is ready. Now we will power it on. Just click on power on virtual machine. I'll just maximize it. We'll select the first option. That is Windows Ubuntu 11.4 and press enter. Okay, here we will click on Windows Ubuntu 11 installer. So we get a graphical user interface and from here we will use this installer. So double click it. So as we have seen in my previous videos, uh, the installation is same. So American English is okay. I'll just click next. Location will be all automatically selected. So click next again. Keyboard layout is English US. Click next. Same way here. Leave everything like that. Just uh, select the uh, first option that says erase disk because there is nothing in the disk. So there is no problem erasing it. Just click next. Now just give it a name. Fill in these details. I'll just type TT and we'll create a password. Now click next. 
click install click on install now so the installation has started it may take some more time so you can just leave it like that Okay, the installation has been completed. We will click on done and it will restart. Uh, we can press enter because we don't have any media connected. Okay, let's log in. So the installation has been completed. We will close this and we will just uh, change the screen resolution. Uh, we will just right click and then click on display settings and select 1920 by 1080. Click apply. And we have a full screen window now. So it is Ubuntu, that is Windows 10 plus Ubuntu. And you get Microsoft Edge, Windows Copilot, Microsoft Office, all Windows applications, uh, even Cortana is there. So if you want, you can install. Uh, any other browser like uh, Google Chrome will just open Microsoft Edge I'll just cancel this we'll go to Google and we'll install Google Chrome We'll select the first option, click accept and install. Click open file. Now click on install on installation wizard. Type your Windows password. And click on authenticate. Okay, and we got the browser that is Google Chrome installed. So we'll click on open. Click OK. We'll close all these other windows. And we have Google Chrome installed. You can also install any Windows file in this Ubuntu operating system which looks like Windows 10. So that's all I wanted to show you in this video. Thank you very much for watching. Please click the like button if you like the video and subscribe to my channel. You have a great day. Bye-bye.